Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Mama Hazi bin Rahimi Metric number 2020113239 So in this topic from my group I will be talking about the introduction about Mercy Malaysia Mercy Malaysia is actually a non-governmental agency which is an NGO responsible for assisting the government in resolving humanitarian issues So basically Mercy Malaysia is a non-governmental organization that helps people in needs internationally or within the country uh, with the support from the government itself so in for example the the most recent example is uh, when the COVID-19 virus spreads uh, the pandemic uh, they were the one that lend help for the people in need uh, in case of food, clothes, shelters, people who were badly impacted by the pandemic itself. So that's, that is about Mercy Malaysia, a little bit about Mercy Malaysia. So that's all for me, thank you. Mercy Malaysia has made a few efforts to reach out for refugees during COVID-19 in Malaysia. First, they provide primary health care in which they offer free medication as well as follow-up care. Second, they provide mobile clinics to reach out with Fiji in remote areas. Third, they provide medical relief to deliver medical in emergency response. And fourth, they recruit volunteers from various professions, medical and non-medical. Lastly, they promote multilateral apps to encourage refugees to register multilateral and to those who are aware of COVID-19 vaccination. So the effectiveness from this program, we can see the Mercy Malaysia always help the people in Malaysia and also other countries who need their help as volunteer from Malaysia in terms of energy facility or donation and started from now many Malaysian people start to support and give given the donation for Mercy Malaysia to they upgrade their facility and always help people in trouble There are two impacts of Mercy Malaysia during the pandemic situation The first one they prevent the increasing number of COVID-19 cases in Malaysia. In number two, the number of vaccinated people that among the Malaysian is increasing. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Muhammad Ahmad Shahmi bin Ahmad Nazila. For this assignment, I met about the challenge of Mercy Malaysia to deal with refugees during the COVID-19 pandemic and I'm going to tell about the points I got for this assignment. Point number one is community connections key to reaching refugees in Malaysia during COVID-19. And the second point is Mercy Malaysia urges undocumented workers to undergo COVID-19 testing. The last point for, the, for this assignment is Mercy Malaysia volunteers help raise vaccination awareness Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Muhammad Hazib bin Rahimi Metric number 2020113239 So the last bit of this topic I will be talking about the conclusion of Mercy Malaysia So basically Mercy Malaysia has contributed a lot to the nation itself as well as uh, raising awareness within the community uh, they have a lot of list of success uh, within the nation itself because a lot of people were glad that Mercy Malaysia were there to help them because this NGO deserve respect for example the recent recent issue is with, is about the COVID-19 pandemic which is a lot of people were badly impacted okay a lot of people lost their jobs and they were suffering they were 
badly impacted, couldn't find any money to eat, to even feed their family. But Mercy Malaysia was there to help them all. And not to mention raising awareness about the things that people don't know, such as homelessness, stuffness of people in the community. So basically, Mercy Malaysia is a good NGO that is supported by the Malaysian Malaysian government in itself, and we all, they are also known as the help from the international within within the world. So that is a little bit about Mercy Malaysia, the contributions about Mercy Malaysia. So that's all from me. Thank you.